All right, so at this AIC meeting, we've heard a lot about plasma AD biomarkers. Um, and in this session on the temporal evolution of AD biomarkers, there were several studies looking at how A beta 42 to 40 and PTAU 217 may be used to track disease progression or um, predict incident amyloid positivity or incident dementia. And uh, some of the highlights were that, um, as has been seen in cross-sectional studies, um, PTAU 217 generally does pretty well. It is able to predict um, incident amyloid PET, incident cognitive impairment um, within, but there are some limitations to that, it, within um, the few years prior to development of those. Um, one of the studies looked at earlier measurements, so midlife plasma measurements for the prediction of late life um, cognitive impairment and amyloid positivity. And in that situation, uh, that 20 year gap was too far uh, for the plasma biomarkers to predict amyloid positivity. Um, the other biomarker of interest has been A beta 42 to 40. Um, and while it has been useful um, for uh, in cross-sectional studies showing or to correlate with amyloid positivity, um, in the longitudinal assessments, um, and the noise properties um, have been challenging uh, for the ability to track disease progression and also uh, for in the utility of it for prediction of uh, future changes.